So, Sooner player Jacob Lacey officially announces his medical retirement from college football. And I'm a little sad to see that this had to happen to this young man, but we're going to talk about him and show him some love. So, but before we do that, welcome to Unfair Sports. I'm your host, Jay. Thank you for pulling up to the channel. You know what it is. Thanks for all the support and love. If you like the content, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. So let's dive into Jacob Lacey. So we talked about him on the live last night. Coach Brent Venables went on with Gabe and Teddy over at the Oklahoma Breakdown. And he gave some updates on some key injuries or whatnot for the team. And one of those was for Jacob Lacey, who now will, who officially tweeted out that he's going to medical, uh, medically retire. And this is what he sent up. So put it out there, tweet this, of course. I've had two pulmonary embolisms incidents in the la- in less than a year. Both times I was told I was lucky to be alive. And so the game I love is taken away from me, but I refuse to let it define me. Sooner Nation, thank you for everything you have done for me and my family. God has a plan. Sad to me that, you know, he's no longer going to play. He's He was a leader out there, right? He, this would been his sixth year, senior. He transferred in from Notre Dame where he's got a degree from Notre Dame. And he came in this past season, gave us 10, 17 total tackles with seven of them being solos, nine of, uh, you know, nine assists and a sack. Uh, that sack against Texas was huge, which, you know, you can see that in the video here. And he had five total hurries, right? You know, he had the sack, he had a hurry and he had, uh, he had a hit in three hurries. And so, He's back there, you know, playing hard, finished with over 385 snaps. And so he had this fear coming into last season and things cleared up and he was able to play and played at a solid level at the defensive tackle position, right? These numbers all come from pro football focus. Um, He was doing it right. You know, we we were excited about him coming back at his size, 6'1", about 285, bringing that veteran presence, being able to come in and help lead some of the younger guys as well as be that experience on the defensive line that we'd love to have him and Dejon Terry. But unfortunately our guys not um, going to be able to play, man. So I want to drop a video thanking him for his service, what he's done for us here at Oklahoma. And I expect him to get another role. Like I said, we talked about it on the live. I anticipate him being very vocal and active with the team, very vocal and active with uh, the players and everything. And so yeah, kind of sad to see it. Pop in the comments, show our boy Jacob some love. Sad to see that he won't be able to play this season, but at the same time, hey, dude's a baller. It's all love, right? If you made it this far, you like the content, please hit that like button if you're new to the channel. Subscribe. Love to have y'all come around here. Talking about you football, college football, SEC football, and having a blast doing it. So, got some more videos dropping. So, check us out, and uh, we'll talk soon. Peace.